I'm looking for a good cover. You know where to find it? Wait, can you do that again? Because the truck messed up the, right. the audio. Hey guys, Lexi here, and we're stopping. But I'm with my best travel partner, Hunter, and we are in Portland, Oregon. We are visiting Hunter's bench coach from the Rangers, Don Wakamatsu. <laughs> the guy just ran across. Kind of wearing the suit version of what I'm wearing. Well, I just saw a dark thing, a suit version of what you're wearing. <laughs> That's funny. Anyways, we just got here last night. We're excited to check out some of their coffee spots because we heard the coffee in Oregon is absolutely amazing. So we're headed to coffee now. We're headed to a place called Good Coffee. And if it's anything like its name, we're gonna like yeah, it. Gonna <laughs> we have passed like four coffee shops on the way to this Yeah. Place, and it, we've only been walking like three blocks. Not even. And they're like all kind of local roasters, like coffee shops I've never heard of. But here's one, public domain coffee. Coffee should be an experience, not just a routine. Portlanders oh. must really love their coffee. Portlanders, yeah, so. We're walking there, so we'll see you guys there. Excuse me, uh, excuse me, I'm like, I'm looking for good coffee. Do you know where to find any? Once again, I'm looking for good coffee. Do you know where to find any? <laughs> hey, good coffee bar inside. This way. A flower bar? This is a very cool space. <laughs> I feel like this is a different coffee experience than we've ever had. This feels like piano and like get dressed up and like, this is amazing. Swanky, I'm way, swanky coffee. I'm way underdressed. <laughs> I would be on those tab boards and of like, don't wear this here. <laughs> Oh, shoot, we gotta get in line. Watches. They're pretty good. So we don't do four overs here. Uh oh. But I actually really like the coffee. It's like super simple. A little too hot for you. Super hot. I forgot. You're not used to the hot. I don't even know what I tasted. I have no taste buds. Don't listen to my review after this. <laughs> I probably shouldn't have done the jalapeno uh, kolache right before I took a sip of the coffee because I'm like on fire. This to me is gonna be like pure like campfire coffee in my opinion. Like, oh, that's a great description for it. Though I think my favorite. Right I like it, but it's not like a lot of the coffees we drink where they're like pour overs and they're really fruity. But this one feels like I don't know if I can say this, but it feels like kind of uh, you want to get bold. And, Okay. Oh, I, let's, let's pause this. We're, we're, we're back. Campfire so, coffee, that's so good. That's a great description. It's like description. campfire, it's kind of like a masculine coffee, but it's not like bitter or or like steaky. It's like a it's like a good... Good coffee? It's a good campfire coffee. <laughs> it's a good coffee? Yeah, it's good. And I got a cardamom latte. I love cardamom. Cute little logo there. I like cardamom a lot in my chives. So I was very excited to try this. Very good. I like this a lot. It's a very nutty flavor. It's a little brisk outside, so I feel like this is it hits all the perfect spot for me right now. Cozy and warm, and it's exactly what I need. Well, that is hot. That is good. That is good. I like it. I'm not even sure if there's caffeine in it. What is it again? It's like the classiest coffee shop we've ever been It really been to. is. Yeah. Everyone's so well dressed. Yeah, like really nice clothes. And like their camels, their black sheets, and like. Like I wouldn't be surprised if they had a live pianist here. Yeah, totally. This is a very classy joint here. <laughs> the good coffee at Woodlark. Beautiful plants everywhere. Everything's super clean. It's Ooh. bright. It's airy. Yeah, the ice latte is 10 out of 10. The ice latte is legit. Cardamom too is like the latte. It was, it's, they're very soft notes, and I feel like it's perfect for this space. The way this space looks is how this cardamom latte tastes. Soft, but fashionable. Yeah. When I look around this place.
always reminds me of like a Meghan Markle. Very classy, very chic. This is a Meghan Markle of latte. Thank you, good coffee. <laughs> All right, the espresso is here. Bravo. Experience. Before you have your espresso, on, on, I'm in the middle of a oh, espresso. So the looks of this is very smooth. But the espresso journey, you go into it and you're in one plane of existence. You're in one world. After you sip that nice espresso, it's not espresso. Espresso, espresso. Espresso Patronum. After you sip that nice espresso and you enjoy it and it warms your soul, you wake up to a whole new world. Something magical happens. And you're excited and you're ready to take, oh baby. It's good. That's a jackpot. Jackpot? That is really good. That's not good coffee, that's really good. Oh yeah. It should be good coffee, really good espresso. Very flavorful. This is it's almost as if a glitter bomb went off on your tongue. That's what that tastes like. Glitter doesn't taste very good. Alright, maybe not a glitter bomb. But I can't see what you're saying because like... It's like an explosion. Yeah, on your but it's like a sour -y. Ooh. And a glitter bomb. Okay, I can kind of see it now. And it just like fizzles out. It's like a boom and then nicely fizzles out. Oh man, it's smooth and velvety. I'm not in the same world I was when this video started. It's like we went through platform nine and three fours. We went through a four. We went through platform nine and three fours. And now we're headed to Hogwarts. <laughs> well, it gets two thumbs from me. Two thumbs from Hunter. For sure. Ten out of ten spot. Hunter and Lexi approved coffee shop. So if you're in the Portland area, definitely check out Good Coffee. They have multiple locations, so definitely look one up. And there you have it. We're gonna go off and explore Portland now after this burrito, of course. And until next time, I'll see you in the chat. Bye! Thanks for watching. If you guys like this video, go ahead and hit that like button. Also, let me know in the comments below what coffee place you want us to check out next. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, go ahead and hit that sub button. And I'll see you guys in the chat. Bye!